Meta was essentially a place where um, you know Bill Harlan wanted to to create a common ground for vintners to come together. He has truly done that. And I am headed to Meadowood, that is up valley. It's almost to Calistoga, so the northern side of St. Helena. And uh, we're gonna spend the night. So do a, a bit of day spa, um, get a massage, and then do a tasting and a pairing. And we'll be meeting with the sommelier as well as the uh, manager of Meadowood. That's where you book your Meadowood trip when you're ready to go. Okay, Wine Pass Travel. You can follow them on Instagram as well. Okay, so um, you mentioned that there are 17 different types of properties here. Yes, so rooms. the rooms, exactly. So on the estate, um, we, we do have 98 rooms throughout okay. the 250 acres. Within those 98 rooms, we do have 17 room categories. Oh my goodness. It's, it sounds like a lot, but <laughs> they are so different and not only their location, but their offerings. Um, so the one common thing between them all mm -hmm. would be the California king bed and a fireplace. Oh. So whether that's wood burning or gas, depending on your preference, um, the the rest of it depends on again location. Right. If you want an extra bedroom, we can have a single studio or we can go up to a four bedroom lodge. Beautiful. So there are whatever our guests or members are looking for, we will have it for them. So where is this beautiful spot? We are yeah. standing on one of the croquet lawns. We do okay. have four of them on property right next to us is the Croquet Lodge. This is one of the existing buildings um, from its or original state from the 60s when it was okay. just a country club. And so with one of our, uh, we have four championship croquet lawns available for our guests and members to enjoy. It is so unique to have these croquet lawns because it's the only play, the only hotel in Northern California that offers this. So we do have a croquet pro on staff available to teach and have a wonderful time. He, his name is Mike McDonald. His father taught here before him. He's wow. extremely enthusiastic, a wonderful personality, uh, but is not the backyard croquet that you're probably thinking of. So instead of long grass, you're hitting it around, having a good time. You still have a good time, but you are in regulation croquet whites, flat soled shoes, and of course, you cannot play without a glass of wine in your hand. Are we playing with white or red wine? That's a great question. <laughs> it's up to you. Okay. I mean, you're wearing white, so I would suggest a wine or rosé, but of course, it's definitely up to you. Okay, let's talk for a minute about the restaurants here because you guys are known for some pretty exquisite food. Yes, yeah, so we have two uh, restaurants on property. We have the grill, which um, manages our in-room dining, the grill itself, and then our pool service as well. Okay. And then we have our three Michelin dining experience, the restaurant at Meadowood, which is, of course, incredible. You can do a fireside snack service, so okay. that's just a small taste, a small glimpse into what you would experience at a uh, the actual di dinner itself, yep. um, all the way ranging up to uh, the the chef's counter, which is a absolutely amazing experience of dining in the kitchen itself, surrounded by the chefs. And you said there's beautiful, really upbeat, fun music, uh, the, and hanging out with the them. experience yeah. is second to none because when you're in the dining room, you feel as if you are immersed in a different world. But but then you go into the kitchen and it is this fun, lively experience of really just watching these chefs do what they do best in their environment and they have to get into that mindset and in order to do so, yes, sometimes music is playing in the background <laughs> I and love you it. just get to enjoy this um, this feeling with them. It's, it's magical. front row seat to what it's they front row really seat. do, exactly. right? Exactly, yes. You get to see how meticulous everything is done in there. It's, it's truly, truly fascinating. That's Monica, yes. my goodness, well, you have cheers. certainly, cheers, filled our glass up with goodness here. Absolutely, Schramsberg Blanc de Noir. Okay, mm -hmm. and what is your role at Meadowood? My role is a state sommelier. Okay. Uh, so I do uh, the wine list for all the outlets on property. Okay. I do the pool, the spa, in-room dining, and then the grill. I also host uh, hotel guests to private educations oh, or fantastic. take them on tours in the valley. Um, sometimes I work with large banquet groups, work with Danielle on these cooking classes, the plate and pear experiences. Um, is that everything? That's a lot. Yeah. <laughs> That's a lot. Okay, so we did a beautiful taste. What mm -hmm. are we tasting? The wine or the flavors? <laughs> Let's start with the wine. <laughs> okay, Shiravsberg Blanc de Noir. Okay. I believe we have the 2015 stuff. Yeah, 2015. 2015. It's mm -hmm. quite delicious. Um, grapes coming from 
it's, it's labeled North Coast, but they'll get grapes from Carneros, Marin, uh, Anderson Valley, Sonoma, and Athens. No wonder it has mm -hmm. such a beautiful expression. They're taking the freshest of everywhere. Exactly, I exactly. Love that. Yeah. Okay. So we're making a spatzel with uh, some, we'll have a bunch of herbs in it okay. and then at the end we'll saute that with some wild mushrooms. Fantastic. Uh, we also have, uh, we're doing a pan roasted chicken breast. Okay. With a oh. quick little jus, a little reduced sauce. Okay. Uh, and then our salad is where the persimmon is going. It's oh. a little gem lettuce with persimmon, avocado, some pistachios. Fantastic. A really nice kind of emulsified dressing that coats everything nice up. You have this gorgeous spa that I keep hearing about, yes. and we're just about ready to head there. I'm so excited for you to experience the spa. It is so wait. unique. It, you can't find this experience anywhere else. It is an all-sweet concept. Um, so our spa director, Michael Conti, came into this. We actually built the spa around his concept. Okay. So instead of going into a common place where you would store your things and be called into a treatment room, instead, you do all of that in your own space. So you go, you have your own space to store your things, you have your own private steam area, you then have your treatment space, oh, and also a consultation space, okay. which after your steam and your treatment, you then have time to yourself to unwind. So if you Fantastic. did want that common area, we do have the, the, the garden lounges. Yes. But other than that, that space is yours to really just truly contemplate, take it in and relax. So I'm, I can't wait for you to experience it. So it sounds like the ultimate indulgence. It is. With privacy. With privacy I on top it. of that. Okay. Yes. Fantastic. And um, in one sentence or a couple of sentences, mm -hmm. What do you think um, shines about Meadowood, or what is it best known for? That is a great question. It's difficult to summarize it into one sentence, but I, Meadowood is just such a special place. And if you are a lover of wine, cuisine, and hospitality, this is the place for you. We, we have so much to offer. Every time you're here, you're going to have a new experience. And not only is the service phenomenal and the facilities lovely, but the feeling you get here, the family, the home, it is unmatched by anywhere else.